Now I'm fully aware of the effects of global warming. I know the penguins and the polar bears, they're losing their habitats because the ice keeps melting. But guys, I could really, really get used to days like this. Start of January and it's 22 degrees. Today we're in Ocean Village, so come join me as we take a look. And there's the thermometer, if nobody believes me. Good afternoon everybody. Today is Wednesday the 3rd of January 2024. And this is our first video of the new year. We've got a couple of videos coming over the next week or so, including us all going on location. So that's all pretty exciting. But today we're going to go through Ocean Village. And we're just going to go for a slow stroll. You'll find out the reason why it's a slow stroll at the end of the video. So let's take a look at the bars and restaurants that line Ocean Village. And we can see there are a couple of people sitting out. But you've got to remember, it's a Wednesday afternoon. It's about four o'clock. So most people are actually in work. There's not a high amount of tourists visiting Gibraltar this time of year. Most people come in the summer months. But yeah, there's still, still a few people about. So it's good to see some life, especially after Christmas. I think everybody's done with Christmas now. I'm definitely feeling like that's the case. We're in the new year. And yeah, looking forward to the summer now. Looking forward to it getting a bit warmer. So yeah, we can see there's some people doing some vlogging as well. It is such a beautiful day, the sun is shining. Any, anyone who's been to Gibraltar and has visited Ocean Village will find this whole area very, very familiar. This is where the majority of the bars and late night activities are situated here. And we even did a nightlife video before i think we're going to do another one again zoo as that was quite popular i think that's what quite a lot of people want to see but here we go i thought that bird on the left was giving us the finger there but the then i zoomed in it was peace signs so yeah it's always good to see people interacting with the camera but let's push on forward now we've almost covered half of ocean village Ocean Village juts out as well onto a couple of piers where you've got some bars and restaurants as well. I'm not going to go snooping too close and spending too much time here because number one, I'm a little bit injured as I say, you'll find out about later. Not only that, I know a few people around here so I don't really want to be seen filming to be honest. But yeah, here we are. Got the obligatory flag shot you know on this channel. I absolutely love a flag shot. But here we go. Take a little spin round. And now we're going to head over. Checking out some of the piers without going on them. But yeah, you've got Wagga Mamas there. Pretty nice. I've eaten there. Yeah, what else can you say? I guess they all taste the same, really. Um, yeah, lovely day four. It's a little bit of shade, so... I'm walking in a funny position so the sunlight doesn't hit the camera because you get that horrible glare. And I, I'm not really too technical, so I don't know how to fix those sort of things. But yeah, as you can see, the restaurants are empty because it is half past four in the afternoon. Not too much life going on here, but you should see in the summer, guys, it's absolutely rammed here. Sometimes I need to leave it a little bit of extra time if I'm getting through Ocean Village to meet someone or go somewhere because it is so so busy so it's quite nice to visit this time of year and as I say 22 degrees on January the 3rd I think that must be we must be the hottest part in Europe it must be except I guess the Canary Islands but some might argue they're in Africa, but yeah, we can see here there's a lot of deals going on. You can see the blackboards outside, so if you're looking for a drink and looking for a deal, you won't be short of offers here in Ocean Village. But yeah, 
Look at this, it's a nice little canal. And do you know what? I've walked over this so many times, but I've never actually really noticed it. So it's good just to stop and have a look. And that's the great thing about going around and filming now. I actually spend more time looking at things instead of just walking past on my day-to-day -day life. So, yeah, we can see the restaurants here all pretty closed up. But as we arrive on this side of Ocean Village, we get a nice shot there of the marina, but this is absolutely hilarious. I actually filmed a minute of this because it was so funny. It's this geezer trying to start his boat in failure. I think he needs some WD-40. I kid you not, guys. This went on for at least three minutes. I've just cut it down for the sake of the video. But there's your maritime content for you guys who want to see that and here we are we're coming to the end of our walk but let's take in some of these beautiful views of ocean village the marina here it's absolutely fantastic and the beautiful sunlight does it so much justice as we take a sweep around the harbour and that will lead out into the bay of gibraltar which eventually, if you go left, you'll end up in the Mediterranean Sea. And if you go right, you'll end up in the Atlantic Ocean. So, yeah. Big focal point for sailors here in Gibraltar. But as we take our last shots, thank you for watching, guys. As always, on this beautiful day. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed our little walk around Ocean Village this afternoon. This beautiful afternoon. I'm sorry I didn't go on such a longer walk or I didn't go into the bar areas or onto the piers and there is a reason for that. A couple of hours before I went to work on New Year's Eve I stubbed my toe on the back of a wooden chair leg and it's absolutely black and broken so I can't really walk too far. It actually is quite painful but apart from that I'm absolutely alright and I'm glad I did come and do this walk. But from me here in Ocean Village, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next adventure.